Of course, there's pressure. I hope to carry the strength of our entire team to conquer the Olympics in Paris. Taiwanese Taekwondo star Ruo Jialing is intensifying her training efforts ahead of the Games as she embarks on her second Olympic journey. Ruo notes that her skills and mindset have reached a new level. With the experience from the Tokyo Olympics, I feel more familiar with the whole process this time. I'll focus on each match. Even if facing the repushage at the end, it will still be a new challenge. Clinch bronze at her Olympic debut in 2021, the 183-centimeter-tall Ruo Jialing demonstrated her prowess under pressure. This time, Ruo will be the sole representative in the Taekwondo event. Carrying the hopes of the entire team, Ruo vows to perform her best to stay centered. There's definitely pressure, but I'm also very excited and a bit thrilled to compete on the Olympic stage. I'll do my best not to let my anxiety get to me. Luo Jialing will compete in the women's 57 kilogram division this time. With 14 other outstanding Taekwondo athletes qualified for the Games, Luo must bring her best to every match to advance. Luo confessed that her greatest challenges were not her skills or mentality, but her injuries. Due to these injuries, Ruo paused international competition for the first half of 2024. To prepare, her coach Liu Congda arranged simulation matches in July. If she goes straight into the Olympics after a six-month hiatus, it's a bit risky. At the same time, we're concerned about aggravating her injury. It's a dilemma, but we'll keep monitoring the situation. Ruo Jialing's father, Ruo Wenxiang, has watched his daughter's journey every step of the way. Seeing her train and push through injuries, he has opened up about his feelings. Of course, his parents, seeing her get injured is very hard for us. But we don't talk about it much. I hope she knows that what matters is that she feels she's given her best and can be proud of herself. She doesn't need to worry about what others think. In fact, Taekwondo has historically accounted for a large medal count for Taiwan. Looking back at the medal tally, at the 2004 Athens Olympics, Chen Shixing won the first gold for Chinese Taipei, followed by Zhu Muyan with a second gold, and Huang Zhishong with a silver. At the 2008 Beijing Olympics, Zhu Muyan and Song Yuqi both won bronze medals. In 2012, Chen Li Chen also secured a bronze. Then in 2021, Luo Jialing clinched another bronze. As more countries invest in Taekwondo training, the competition continues to intensify. I have a goal to strive for. Also, during training, I have a clearer target. Hoping to reach for glory once again, Ruo Jialing is determined to fine-tune her form in the final preparation sprint. Lan Yuming, Zhang Jiabao, Huang Qihou, TVBS World, Taiwan.